In the 19th century, a new species joined the local fauna of the region, the domesticated sheep. Though the land is very poor and so useless for agriculture, its wide plains can support extensive grazing, and from early on, sheep and cattle farming became the main activity across the vast expanses of Patagonia. The arrival of the sheep meant not only a new species competing for the scarce pasture of the region, it also brought with it indiscriminate hunting of the local fauna, either because they were a threat to the sheep, or for their meat, or in the case of the birds, their feathers, guanacos and rares were subjected to enormous hunting pressure, which drastically reduced their numbers. Today, fortunately, the different species that live on the peninsula are protected and no longer have to worry about attacks from humans, only the natural predators that still inhabit the peninsula. Like the Mara, the armadillo lives in a state of constant alert, and it runs off at any suspicious noise. The fox is not a dangerous predator, but you can never be too careful, especially when you're a long way from your burrow. The only way to feel safe is to dig a new one, and fast. 